content boxes like you see here are a great way to make your site look professional. So I'm going to show you how you can add one of these nice boxes to your site, either with top tabs or left tabs. So on this site right here, I have a page, and I want to add some information to it. So I've already written that information out. And as you can see, the way I have it organized, we have four different subsections of content here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to quickly copy that content and then I'm going to open up the back end of this page right here. And what we're going to do here is up on the top menu, we're going to select add ET tabs. So that's going to open up this box here. For this one, we're going to use some left tabs. Uh, we're going to leave the auto at no. We just want people to manually click through it. We don't want it to automatically skip from tab to tab. And then we have to go and just add in the content for each tab. So as you can remember, we had four different tabs here. I'm just going to go and copy paste. pull out the title from here. Okay, so we have our first tab. For architectural, we have the top text and then the content. So we have four tabs for this one, so we have to click add one more tab. I'm going to paste in the next one. So this one is financial. One more. This one's maintenance. And finally, the last one is owner. So I've added in the content for my four tabs, selected left tabs, you can select top tabs, and we are all good. So we're going to click OK. And there you have it. So the content's been pasted in. So if we update it on the front end of the site, you'll see that we have this nice clean table. So within that table, you can go back in here and clean it up and add in photos if you want, uh, align them and wrap the text, and really make it look clean. But that is the basics of adding the ET tab content box.